Some of you may remember this, but a long time ago, this didn't used to be the nether. This was never like the nether. It did not have this kind of nether rack. It did not have gold ore, obviously since the 1.16 nether update came out. These weren't these weren't zombie pig, zombified piglin. I mean like look at all of this. This didn't used to be the way. Now, obviously I'm not talking about only the Nether. Now, if I can find my way back, my way back. Oh, okay, there we are. But obviously I'm not talking about only the Nether, but I'm also talking about the overworld as well. This was not always the way. And what I'm talking about here is that some of the veteran Minecraft players may know this, but the textures have changed over the years, 100%. So guys, Today I'm going to be showing you how to get all of these old textures back for free. So some of you newer players or some of you older players that used to that loved the older textures can play like that again. And for the newer players, you can experience what some of our us veteran Minecraft players was like. Now for me, I've been playing Minecraft since 2013, so I definitely have some experience with this as well. So this is exciting for me. So anyway, let's get straight into the video. Now the first thing that you're going to need to do is this only works for Bedrock Edition. I'm just going to say this right now. It only works for people with Minecraft Windows 10, Bedrock Edition, Pocket Edition, someone with the Marketplace, because this is what you're going to need mainly. So basically, as soon as you get in, you're just going to go into the Marketplace, all right? So you're just going to go to the little microscope, or I'm sorry, the search bar and you're just gonna go search up minecraft textures no spaces or it doesn't really matter just put in minecraft texture and right here the second one is the minecraft class classic texture pack now guys i already own this but for some of it for you it will say free this does not cost any money and now the cool thing about this is since it's by minecraft straight from the store you do not have to worry about any viruses since obviously this is minecraft it's not going to give you a virus and two this is straight from their shop so it's not going to be any kind of you know scam from a website or anything so all you have to do is you just need to click on this and you need to click activate texture pack and as soon as you do that it'll send you to your settings now if this doesn't show you i'll just show you the manual way you're just going to go straight to your settings go down scroll down to global resources and over here you'll see my packs and some of you may have other packs here but the one you're looking for is minecraft classic texture pack you're just going to click that and press activate and as if you click on the active active tab and you see it there it means you're ready to go now afterwards it'll take some time to load and we will hop into it and see straight away some of the old textures let's get right into it ah uh, old minecraft now one thing straight away that i noticed is for some reason i had some pumpkins in my inventory pumpkins this jack-o-lantern face was a little bit different from before so yeah i'll post a picture or something of what it used to look like maybe i'll maybe sometime i'll do something in the future to show you but for right now let's go hop into the um underworld the nether because this is the main thing that's really weird it looks so weird for some if you don't remember this but anyway let's just hop in <laughs> look at this look at this it looks like brain goop it just looks like yeah it looks like brains this is what old netherrack used to look like and oh my look, look at that look at that this is old lava textures man it, it oh, oh man this reminds me of like hot pockets you know what i'm talking about like the cheese inside of hot pockets this is what it looks like this is what this reminds me of i don't know if it's just me but yeah now guys obviously some of these textures will not be changed because obviously some of them weren't changed over the years and some of them are just because they're brand new and they weren't from the old such as the 1.16 nether update so the crimson forest or anything won't be anything different now, huh? no way, I didn't, rem I didn't know this. That's actually a really nice surprise. Wait, 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 do they, is it called zombie, Z zombified piglin? Or back to zombified piglin. <laughs> for those of you that, this is the old pigmen. So for those of you that like are mourning, I know that most of, some of them are, are, are really sad that the pigmen are just, gone 
and many of you are really sad about this, you can get it back with this texture pack. That's so cool. Look at this. They're no, no longer piglins. That's actually so cool. Now guys, obviously I'm not 100% on some of these and well, I'm not an expert on textures. I don't read them, but I don't know. You guys can look around and tell me if any of these textures are different in the comments because I'm not really see for me personally. Now, obviously striders, like I said, or um, piglins, if you find any piglins, will not have any new textures since obviously they are new and they won't be old. So yeah, this is this is the main big looking thing since legit everything is netherrack in it. You you just see all this brain goop and almost everything's lava. Everything's just hot pocket cheese, you know. And now, guys, let me just show you in the overworld. Now, first thing straight away, I'll say, these leaves are definitely different. Some, um, if you can't tell, this is definitely different. Um, but yeah, I definitely think I agree on the more newer versions. I think it's way more realistic looking, and I kind of enjoy that about it. Now, guys, one thing I do see over there is a village. So, we're actually going to check that out real quick. And oh my goodness, is that more? Yep, some more hot pocket cheese. Hello there, villagers. And oh my goodness, you you can definitely see the difference in the cobblestone. Yeah, this is this is definitely different um from the new um newer cobblestone. But actually, for this one and the mossy cobblestone as well, since they're almost the same thing, I kind of like the older one. I actually do. So yeah, that's one thing towards um team older version now one thing i if you can't tell is that these little dots over here all these mini dots weren't here before so that's something i do like about new york because th these dots are actually kind of annoying i'm not gonna lie now guys i do want to show you this so let me quickly go into game mode um survival so if you look at the carrots <laughs> this is not a normal carrot some of you may not notice this but this is definitely not a normal carrot. And the other thing is, <laughs> look at the old wheat texture. That's not your normal wheat. That is definitely not your normal wheat. Now guys, I do kind of wish I found one of these, but anyway, I'll just show it, hang on. Let me get away from this creeper real quick. I don't want it to explode the village. Oh, never mind. I don't have to go into game mode, see. But look at this. This is hay bales, guys. Now, you may not notice it, but there is a, definitely an extra ribbon, this dark red ribbon, that is added to the hay bales. And guys, for me, I actually personally like it. That's one point towards old. But yeah, I actually like the older texture better than the newer texture. Now, guys, I actually am, since I do want to show you the difference between this, if you can't really tell, and I don't, I'm not going to take a picture for every single one of these. So let me go quickly change back to new, the new textures, and you guys will definitely see a difference. Now, everyone, um, while I'm doing this, I'm just going to show you how to take off this texture pack, obviously, since some of you, after you put it on, may not want it back on. So basically... All you want to do, everyone, is just go back to your settings, scroll down to global resources, and right here is your active packs, the one that we show. You just press deactivate, while, and that's exactly what you want. And as soon as it's gone from active, you know it's all right. So guys, let's just go straight back into our world, and let's see the difference, guys. And bam. Look at, look at that, man. Now, you can see the carrot, you can see the carrot difference right away. Definitely, oop, I keep pressing E for some reason. But you can definitely see the wheat and carrot difference that I showed you. And yeah, as you can see, the one of the ribbons is cut off. And yeah, I kind of I kind of liked it. It makes it look a lot more bold. Now, everyone, this is what it looked like before the oak planks. It's not that big of a difference, obviously, but there's not those big black dots everywhere. Now, actually, I'm going to take something back. Cobblestone, yes, I still enjoy the older version of it. But the mossy cobblestone, I actually, yeah, I never noticed this. But yeah, I definitely enjoy the more newer co mossy cobblestone because it just looks more realistic to me. But definitely to um, older cobblestone is what I like more. So if we could just get this more realistic cobblestone, more realistic vines on um, the older cobblestone will definitely be a big thumbs up for me. 
now everyone this is a quick little back view of it and yeah this is what it looked like before and there's a lot of zombie villagers now everyone let's just get straight back on to our older textures now everyone since i think the villagers okay quickly if you i'll show a hand-to-hand -hand version but yeah you can definitely see the wheat difference of the growing wheat i forgot to show you that but you may have seen that um, from the old to new village. Now everyone, now since I think there's not much we can do, I think we're just going to look through. Oh no, oh, no, 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 no. No, this wasn't really changed. Um, this was changed actually pretty recent, but this was the old grass blocks. Oh, oh, I love the new grass. I mean, grass. Why am I saying grass? Glass blocks. I just love the newer ones because you can barely see out of this. There's, you don't need these little pixels in it. There's no need for these. Now it's it's really difficult to see. And I and before I met barriers, I I used to just hate glass. I just wanted to squish it up. Just no. I don't. I want to have a window that you can actually see through. Now something also I'm not entirely sure about, but I'm pretty sure these iron bars look a bit different in the newer version. So I'm not entirely sure on that, but yes. <coughs> Hello, little piggy. That's something I never noticed. Look at that totem one dying. It's so perspective. It, it just looks actually really gross looking. That, that's just not right. That, that's no, just no. <laughs> I definitely, thumbs up, newer totem of dying, definitely looks way more better. Now something also I've seen, I've noticed is on the icons of these, I'm pretty sure it's a little more darker to me personally. I don't think they had this kind of outline. Um, but yeah, that's me personally, I'm not entirely sure. But yeah, other than that, I think that's going to wrap up this video. So guys, thank you all for watching. Please comment down below any other old texture packs that I may have not told about in the comments below. And guys, make sure to like, subscribe if you enjoyed this video. And subscribe if you want to miss any, you don't want to miss any of my newer videos. It's completely free. Now anyway guys, thank you all for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Goodbye.